We're still working on this. It'll be great. Okay, we're about to read a Bible story. A Bible story of Thomas, the twin. Do we have any, we don't have any twins here this year, do we? Do we have any twins out there? One? A fraternal twin. Uh, yeah, I don't think you have a twin. Uh, not, not exactly yet. His name is Thomas, so it makes sense. But Thomas was a twin, and he was a very important disciple, especially in this gospel story of John. That folks, you too. And in the story we're about to read, it was on the day after, it was after sundown, after Easter, and into this room where all the, where many, where many of the disciples had gathered. A few of the disciples had gathered, but Thomas wasn't among them. And that room was, guess what? It was locked. It was probably dark because it was after sundown. And it was probably very, very quiet. And so right now, what we're gonna try and do is be a little quiet. Not, not just because we like people to be quiet, but because we need, and everybody here needs sometimes a little silence to think and to consider very hard what world we are in and how we interact with that. And then there are those people around us who may need a little quiet too for them to understand what their life is going on. So just for a few moments, let's try to be as quiet as we can. They like to concentrate, and some of us need, at some times, a little quiet to concentrate and to think about what really matters in our lives. And that's one of the great things about the church, one of the great things about worship, that you get a moment to be quiet and to think seriously. So, repeat after me, if you would. Dear God, Thank you for these moments. Moments when we're with our friends. When we're laughing out loud. And moments when we can be quiet. And think about those around us. All this we ask in your name. Amen. Amen. Now, I'm going to invite you to go and sit with your parents. Here. And then. Well, and